What's good guys, I'm Zombie Gaming here again, and welcome to Toronto. So this is a brand new game available on Steam Greenlight, it's early access, and made by 16-Bit Knights, which is a pretty small developer, but uh, he's one of my good friends. Uh, I've showcased a couple of his games in the past, he's allowed me to play them. Um, he makes some great stuff like Flesh Eaters and Cosmic Dust and Rust. And this game he's been working on for a while. You know, he's, uh, he's posted on Facebook. I think he went to showcase it at an indie game convention as well. But this game he's been working on for a while. And I wanted to show it to you guys. I want to bring you guys my live reactions to the game. Um, you know, show you guys what it's all about. You guys can pick it up on Steam Greenlight if you want. He actually sent me a code, so I'm playing it for you guys today. And we're going to go in. You guys are going to see my live reactions. Um... So huge shout out to him for letting me play this game for you guys. I'm super excited. Um, and, you know, it's highly inspired by the, the myth of the Labyrinth and the Minotaur, which I am a huge fan of. I love Greek mythology. So guys, let's do this. Um, there's achievements too, which I don't think are available in this version. Because you can't click on it. But, let's start the game. Uh, I haven't started the game, so I guess continue. I guess it's just always there. So new game on normal. Let's go. I'm excited to see this game. To the light. Press any key. So chapter one. Oh, any key, not my mouse. First set foot in the dark. The unknown was overwhelming. It was still something familiar. Okay, that's cool. There's voice acting. I wasn't there for the first time. Whoa. Okay, so that's that's I just came in here. So WAC to move, mouse to look around. There's some stuff here. So we're kind of just wandering around in the maze. Upgrades are permanent. Hold E and interact. So there's. May the gods give me strength. Oh, so these are just random little spots in the maze. Thank you, Apollo. Light will be the weapon that will pierce the darkness. Oh, that's cool. So what is remove obstacles? Okay, so you can get upgrades. You can remove obstacles. I'm not sure what the upgrade does. Upgrades are permanent, that so it's. So, hard. so it's maybe the upgrade allow. Yeah, it looks like strength. Something with time, maybe a light upgrade armor. Um, so maybe the strength allowed me to do that. Okay, that's cool. Reach the exit alive. Oh, I can see some some claw marks on the ground. Alright, let's go. Now there's no turning back. Okay, oh, I didn't read that. Crap. Chapter one, dangers in the dark. The music is awesome, and so is the so is the voice acting. That is super cool. Okay, so you can run. Okay, that's cool. Watch out for traps though. How do you disarm them? <laughs> Apparently I wasn't fast enough. Oh shoot! Oh, you have health and stamina. I didn't see that. Yet. Oh, and so look at the top. The top right is our upgrade. So we got a light upgrade. So that allows us to do different things. The labyrinth hides mystical things. Some traps can be avoided by following clues. Oh, that's cool. Oh, this is cool. Okay, there was a trap there, but but we didn't find it. Okay, so let's go down. Okay, so look, so there's different little chapters kind of in different little sub areas within this same chapter. The enemy within. Okay, we might meet the Minotaur here. What was that? Oh, these are like swinging ball and chains. Oh, oh. Okay, we dodged them. That's good. That's good. Oh, guys, this game looks sweet. Loc locate your enemy. How do you do that? Oh. By all the gods, what is that creature? Oh, shoot. So show me where he is. Okay, so those eye things are quite useful. He's over that way. I don't really want to... Oh. Well, I can just go away from him. Do I have to fight him, though? I kind of want to find out what happens. Oh, jeez, he's right there. Hey, dude. Yeah, we're just... I'm kind of scared. I don't want to know what happens. We're just gonna we're just gonna deuce out of here. Okay, so he so the Minotaur is now awake, is what it said. I couldn't. I I should have looked. Choices matter, huh? Okay. Let's check this out. That might be a little uh, Easter egg. Each path has its own challenges and rewards. Okay, we're gonna go with the left path because. Oh shoot! I like the left. I didn't see that thing. It's cool. You have a health bar. It's not like. One hit and you're dead. Oh, shoot. Okay. Let's see if we can find him real quick. Okay, so he's a little far away. So we can use that pretty much at any time. 
We're gonna pick up this upgrade. We're gonna get... Dude, oh man, this game is cool. Okay, so that... Oh, look at my armor. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, 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 okay. So each path has its own rewards and stuff, which... Oh, he's right there! Which I assume means upgrades? Okay. Oh, I have stamina. Oh, and the Minotaur alert is at low, so I guess he hasn't seen me yet? Oh, shoot. Oh, dude, this is so cool. Okay, we gotta clear this stuff. Okay. Okay, dude, the sound... Oh, shoot. The sound design is awesome. Okay, we can trigger that crap, dude. My health is so low. I'm gonna die. There's another upgrade here. I wanna be careful to keep looking for the Minotaur. Okay, we have time. I don't know what that is. I assume one of them is stamina. Oh! Oh, hey! Oh, 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 oh. Crap, I don't have any stamina. Oh, no. Oh, the, oh, the, the traps. Oh, gosh. Boy, that's not good. I need to find the exit. Oh, shoot, I got hit! Dude, this game is dangerous. Oh, crap, that's another upgrade that I can't get. Oh! Oh, the AI! Oh, it's too good. I'm trying to save up my stamina. All right, we're deucing out of here. Oh, crap. No, I'm dead. Ah, oh, shoot. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, man. Okay, continue. Yes. Okay, we have two continues. Okay, so maybe you have to start the chapter over. See, okay, right off the bat, let me tell you something that I'm noticing. The upgrades are cool. I don't know what all of them mean, but that's kind of, I guess, the fun of exploring. Um... I don't know if I want to, like, waste time or anything, but, um... More confusing by the, the end of the Oh, crap. Okay. So, it's definitely... It definitely seems like there is a punishing factor here. Um, you can get upgrades, but the Minotaur can get alerted. You have stamina. There's a bunch of stuff that can kill you. Just the nature of this game is not something we see very often. Um, and... That's so cool to me. This reminds me of games... Ah, oh crap. Of games that I play as a kid. Shoot. Of games that I have played as a kid, or, you know, games that I just don't see that much, that require skill, and that are gonna take some... that have a learning curve, and... Oh, wow. It's just so unique. It's so cool. Oh. Is there an upgrade here? What does this do? Oh, crap. Oh, crap, there's spikes there. See, I would. Okay, this is the way the Minotaur came. Wait, what does that do? I can seal him in? Where is it? Oh, shoot. Crap, okay. See? Oh! So you have to, you have to lose him. So that you can actually get the upgrades and whatnot. Crap, dude. I don't know how you dodge those. You have to, like, can you jump? No, you can't. Are we going to take this? We got this last time. <laughs> time slows around me, such the power of Kronos. Oh, oh, the exit. Oh, sweet, that's the exit. Okay, so we didn't get to explore as much as I thought, or as much as I would have liked to. So that's choices matter, and this is to be or not to be. Okay, this is... this. Oh, 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 oh. Can I... Sl can I... Can I close... Oh, no. I can only... Oh, shoot. Oh, gosh. Okay. Oh, I gotta look at the snakes on the ground to dodge the... Dodge those. Okay. If I can grab this real quick. Is this a light upgrade? I think. Yeah, yeah. That makes my light better. Okay, so that... Those... Oh, crap, dude. How do you dodge those? Or do you not step on the pressure pads? Aha. So there are quite some hidden mechanics in this game. Oh. Which snake do you do? Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. All right, let's grab this. This game is so cool. This game is so sick. Oh, guys, we're going to do a full-blown series of this. I think it's... Oh, crap, that's the wrong snake. Okay. S stay on this one. Okay, let's see where he is real quick. You open up the eye. Okay, he's coming down. He's in the room we were just at. Okay, that's a pressure pad. Oh, the little... Oh, man, you have to pay so much attention to detail here. Okay, we're gonna go left. Always go left. I don't know. That's just something I like to do. Gotta pay attention to the ground, though. Oh, that makes you slow? Okay, good to know. 
shoot. Don't be scared. Oh, I must go back. I must go back. There's no hope for me here. I feel like I'm losing my mind. This is a dead end. Is it a dead end? Oh, it probably is. Maybe. This pro. Oh. I can't do this, and I'll never make it through to the. Crap. Crap. Okay, so if if that kind of stuff happens, uh, just run or. Oh. Okay. This is gonna take some major juking, but I think if. So you have health, but if, if the Minotaur catches you, it might be a one-shot. Yeah. So if he catches you, it's over. So we have one continue left. We gotta beat this chapter now. Oh, man. There is a very real sense of tension in this game. And obviously, you know, graphics aren't everything, but I love the art style of the game. Uh, it's very, very cool. Did we get bigger? That's what it looked like. Oh, crap. Okay, so the brown, the little hollow ones are ones you do not want to go on. Okay, this is the snake we want for this path. Okay, we're good. Alright, so this, and, and the it's, it's enough story to get you intrigued, but it's not like, it's not like, hey, just completely covering everything in, in story. What does that do? This seems important. Oh, that refills your health! Oh, dude! I just walked carelessly into that. Arrows do some damage. We're not gonna go... We're not gonna go left this time. There are dead ends in this area. Lots... Well, at least one. Okay, that... The tree stuff looks like it's dead ends. To get you confused. Okay, we gotta break this. Make sure Mr. Minotaur is not coming over here. Okay, we're good. We're good. Crap. He sounds he sounds angry. I'm just watching. So we cannot get hit by him. We're just gonna walk for now. Crap. That music typically means he's close. We just gotta keep moving. Okay, there's the exit. Nice. So we beat chapter one. That is awesome. Sweet. So chapter one is good and finished. So there we go. There you have it, guys. Oh, that is so cool. That that is so cool. Uh, you got Steam Greenlight. Oh, hello. Going to Steam Greenlight. Let's vote for it right now, guys. Yes. Uh, we're gonna sign in real quick. We're doing this live, guys. We're doing this live. Let's go. This game. Okay. So we're gonna do this. I'm gonna vote it up, obviously, because. Uh, I, I believe that, I believe that this game has potential, and yeah, there's definitely some, some horror there, and it's supposed to be coming out in summer, yes, and see, um, upgrades and stuff, very cool, let's go back to this, um, oh, that's so cool, so it's gonna have achievements, obviously this game is, is early access, so, chapter one is the only, oh, there's custom maps too, round, of, let's check that out, let's check out the custom map. Let's check out the custom map. Can I not? Oh, he's not. Probably not out yet. Okay, gotta pay attention to the ground. But this game is very cool. I love this game. I want to see it. I want to see it do well, guys. This is so cool. So, parts I like about it. The art style is awesome. I think the gameplay itself is unique. I've never really seen gameplay like it before. Oh, hello! I've never really seen, like... You don't typically see games like this that that offer this kind of gameplay. Um, I like how it's not just running through a maze. I like it how there are different puzzles and stuff that you have to be aware of and be mindful of. And it's not just mindless running. That's cool. We're just going getting all these upgrades. Okay, so that's where the Minotaur is or where he spawned. I'm assuming he's... Yep, okay, okay, okay. Oh no! Dude, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I don't know how to dodge these... Those things. Did I not get this one? Okay, okay, okay. And the fact that there's already, like, support and stuff for, for custom maps is, is cool. Um, I think... Oh man, that's so cool. So this is, this is pretty addicting. Pretty addicting stuff. I'm gonna see if I can grab this. Oh! Okay, so yeah, his alert. If you get him on alert, um, 
crap, I died. See, I didn't see the staircase anywhere. I see this map. I get why it's called round and round because there's like four little areas. Um, but okay, guys, that is Toronto's. Very cool that that right off the bat you get the option. Um, once there's mod support and stuff, hopefully there's a platform that you can make maps off of. And there's already three difficulties. So if you guys want to see more of this game. Um, you know, we beat it, but if you guys do want to see it on a hard, harder difficulty, let me know. Um, wow, that's cool. That is so cool. This game is, it's very unique, I'm not gonna lie. Um, right now, obviously there's only one chapter, but I'm really hoping that there's more in the future. That's what I hope. Uh, I think the game itself has, has enormous potential. It could, it could, it could be a lot of stuff, and... The fact that there's no story right now might limit some of that to an extent um, in terms of of the repetition. But as if if you can, if if you know the developers and stuff find a way to to keep it, you know, progressive, get you you know keep getting you those upgrades. Um, you know, you have the chapter one. You know, maybe like ten chapters or something in a different campaign. Stuff like that, even a multiplayer mode might be cool where one person's the Minotaur and like there's, there's you know, three other survivors in the maze. It's very cool. It's very cool. So, um, I'm definitely looking forward to see more of this game. Hopefully you guys are too. Hopefully you guys got a nice sneak peek at what this game is going to be. Um, this is probably the only video out on YouTube right now because uh, I don't think anyone else has access to this game. So... Yeah, that's going to do it for us today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I I am looking forward to this game. I am really looking forward to this game. I want to see more of it. I love the gameplay. I think overall right now it's awesome. And uh, I can't wait to see what it turns into in the future. So go vote this up on Steam Greenlight. I definitely did. I, I, I think the game is awesome. Um, so yeah, that's going to do it for us today. Thank you everyone so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Another big shout out to 16-Bit Nights for hooking me up with this game. If you guys did enjoy, be sure and slap a like on it for me or subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, I'm Zombie Gaming MC, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!